Right now we're heading to Michael Camp's office in Bethpage, um, getting ready to do a little a little therapy work, uh, getting ready to do some uh, strength work so I can get nice and powerful for my November 20th fight in uh, Augusta, Georgia. Yeah, I just signed a new deal with Titan FC. Um, they're a good organization, they're televised and everything. Um, in my opinion, it's like a little step up from the ring of combat where I used to fight at. And so right now I'm just trying to, you know, climb another podium. Uh, this is the this is the same grind. I'm always I'm always grinding out with these guys. I'm currently right now I'm seven and zero, and all of that is old, you know, to my team now. You know, Keith Trimble, Sparrow Volantis, Mike Camp, Joe Scarola, Tony Ritchie, you know. And so just grinding it out. Um, so glutes come down, they insert this way, the fiber orientation. So again, we want to look at this function. It's pretty good, but it feels a little tight. You know, muscles overlap in different layers. So I feel some restriction right through here. We can dig through iliacus on this side, where it kind of dives through with the hip flexor area. Paso is major, Paso is minor. Um, Iliopasoas comes together, supposedly. So uh, just kind of free up all that area. So his hip mobility improves, and the flexibility increases as well. Just now, did a whole lot of leg stuff with the sled pushes to help me like drive through a takedown, help me pull through tough positions. A lot of leg stuff, explosive movements. If I get under a guy, hopefully he goes right up, <laughs> no struggle. And just now to push us with the resistance bands, you know, you're attacking different areas coming up. And then the cruncher, super set, you need a strong core to do almost everything. So um, now I have. Uh, Med ball burpees, um, some curls, and then we all get to go. So I get this done now. Well, right now I'm currently on the stem machine uh, with a little heat, get my shoulder loosened up because I'm getting ready to do some stand up work with uh, Keith Trimble at Belmore Kickboxing Academy. So you don't want to go over there tight. You never want to do that. So right now I'm getting loosened up. Um, I finished up strong on my workout. If my time is correct, finished from start to finish of the actual workout it was right around 38, 40, 40 minutes, and which is good timing for me. That's a great pace, Mike's. That's where Mike wants me to be at. Um, so right now I'm just you know doing this. I'm gonna go take my post protein shake and get ready. I wanted to get into MMA um, after an experience I had in college. I uh, wrestled from seventh grade all the way through my college years. And one of my teammates on my team, um, JT Hudson, he, he fought MMA and he actually held a 145 pound title. And, you know, asked me if I'd work out with him, put on the gloves and shin guards and all that stuff, and I thought nothing of it. And uh, so we started exchanging at boxing at first, and then we added in kicks, and I took a few kicks. I was, you know, they hurt, and so I wanted to give one back. When I went to kick back, he checked it, hit me with a straight left, and after that, I was like, you know what, I'm going to learn this, and I'm going to get him back. Right. Punch. 
Hey guys, just finished up over there at Belmore Kickboxing Academy with Keith Trimble. Getting ready to go in here at Scarola Jiu Jitsu in New Hyde Park. Got some animals in there Gregor Gillespie, Carlos Rosado. What's up? So, we're gonna go in there. We're gonna get about like a couple of five minute matches going, and you know, hopefully everything goes well. I do well. You would switch it to this. This is where you go. This is Dars. You set up Dars from here. But if I went one, two, this is where you set myself up. Okay. Yeah. So from here. So look from here. Look, I would sit through here. One. Okay. Yeah. My left hand would come underneath. Two. I feel all right. Uh, I did not get tapped today, so I'm very happy. Uh, you know, worked on that north-south position, which is a position I get into a lot. So, you know, I think me learning. A lot of different moves off of that would help me up my ground game a lot, be able to threaten. So. What about the guys here? Who? How do you you train with Gregor a little bit? Um, I literally see Gregor every single day. Um, every single day. Extremely, extremely hard worker. Um, very, very talented. I mean, Greg is a, you know, Division One national champion. You know anything about the sport of wrestling, you know those are tough people. And, you know, we got Sup here, he's a purple belt world champion. And he's ranked number one by the IB, JJ or something like that. Carlos, who's, oh, he's a, you know, high level brown belt, taps blacks all the time. You know, he's he's ranked up there as well. I mean, couldn't ask for, you know, better guys to help you on the ground. The new contract means that uh, we just got a new place. We're not too far from where the beach would be at. So, you know, wife and daughter being originally from Colorado, there's not, too, there's not any beaches over there. So she could, uh, you know, finally get to take advantage of that. And you know, for me, that's that's above everything else. You know, having having that around because I didn't I didn't really have a father figure growing up, so uh, it's good to give that to somebody, especially my somebody. I want the UFC world title. You know, I honestly, honestly believe that if I work hard enough, I can get it. And so the only thing now to do is just to put in that work. So that's what I'm doing.